Hey guys, today another show, another episode about underrated and overrated in orthodontics. And the topic now is indirect bonding. And this is quite a tricky one to, to think about that. Because when you look at efficiency on, uh, on precision, moving work from your office into the lab or in front of a computer, and then obviously IDB, indirect bonding, is a great thing to do. The problem is that it's still not working that well for the most of us, even though that many of us now invested in 3D printing and everything, and I do that myself. And I try to force this because I think it's the future and it will be so much better if we could make IDB to the standard procedure that we use in all our clinics but it's still not as good as we think it could be. It saves time here and there, um, but not an overall share time because the assistants have to do a lot of after work. Um, when you do your preparation on the computer, there's still some work to be done, even though AI is taking over responsibilities. And from that point of view, it's quite hard. And I would say just now, it's still a little bit overrated but i think we should invest more time more thinking in it to improve it really fast because i think it's underrated